So today we're going to be checking out this Squire Classic Vibe 70s Telecaster. Stay tuned. <laughs> Welcome to the Guitar Manifesto channel, hope you're all doing well. So today we're checking out this Squire Classic Vibe Telecaster 70s Deluxe model finished in a cool looking Olympic white. So these are a bit of a throwback to the 70s fenders. Um, in the downside hasn't got that bullet truss rod which would have looked really cool and very 70s. You've got the large headstock, you've got vintage style tuners but it hasn't got the F style tuners or the free bolt neck like the 70s ones but you know I suppose they got to make them competitive in terms of prices and things like that would cost a lot of money. So these retail for around £330 brand new. This is a used model. I picked this up on eBay. It is a 2019 model virtually like brand new. So up close and personal you've got that Olympic white paintwork on a poplar wood body really good weight to it, this weighs around three and a half kilos, I don't know what that equates to in pounds, so Google is your friend there, but definitely a good weight to it, a lot of people say poplar wood is, you know, light and thin, but this is definitely got a nice bit of heft to it, uh, you've got a black deluxe pick guard, so basically this is a bit different to your standard telly, this is more like your Gibson style setups, you've got a three ply black Pit guard. So you've got a three-way selector switch to control these Fender Design down Nico wide range humbucking pickups. You've got a volume tone control for each pickup. You've got three positions on that selector switch. So you've got the neck both together and just a bridge pickup. This has got a string through body, hardtail bridge with your Fender style bent saddles there. Really cool feature on these. On the side there you've got the output cup. And you've also got a belly cup for the more mature figures like myself. Onto the neck, you've got a maple neck, maple fingerboard, vintage tint gloss to it, it's got a gloss finish to the, the fingerboard there, you can see that in the light. 25.5 uh, inch scale, so 25 and a half inches from the nut to the saddles. You've got 21 frets, 9 and a half inch radius fingerboard. It's got the tall narrow frets, the sort of vintage style, black dot markers. Again you've got that 70 style headstock, you've got a bone nut which is 42 millimeters. vintage style tuners which are always my favourite, crafted in Indonesia, skunk stripe down the back, gloss finish to the back of the neck and again a full bolt neck plate. It's just a shame, you know, they didn't have put the free bolt on but you know, yeah, they got to keep them competitive but there you go. So yeah this was a used model um, when it arrived, all I needed to do was just give it a quick setup, adjust the saddle height just to get the strings where I like them sitting. The neck relief was good on it. There's no sharp frets, quality control. It is absolutely flawless. There's not a mark on it, and a really cool looking guitar. I do like the contrast of the Olympic white, black pick guard, and that maple neck with that vintage tint to it. So for today's demo, I'm going to play to a backing track going through the three different playing positions, so the neck, both pickups together and just that wide range humbucking pickup on its own. So I guess the next thing is plug her in, see what she sounds like. <laughs>
So there you go, that was a Squire Classic Vibe 70s Telecaster Deluxe, finished in Olympic white. Again, brand new, these retail for around £330. Awesome guitar, really classy looking. I do like the Deluxe Telecaster models. I must admit, they do look very cool indeed. Olympic white paintwork on a poplar body. You've got the belly cut, string through body, three-way selector switch, three-ply black pick guard. You've got them two Fender Design Nico wide-range humbucking pickups. Volume tone control for each pickup there. Output jack. Maple neck, 9.5 inch radius, 25.5 inch scale. Narrow tool frets, black dot markers. Bow nut, large headstock, vintage style tuners, crafted in Indonesia, vintage tint to the neck, skunk stripe, and just a very cool looking guitar. So let me know in the comments below what you think to the, the classic Vibe Tele, whether you preferred the neck, both pickups together, or the bridge. So again, for £330, you can get yourself a really cool guitar. Keep an eye on the used market, they are starting to sharp now, and you can pick yourself a a bit of a sweet deal on one of these so if you enjoyed today's video please give the video a thumbs up subscribe to the channel hit the notification bell so you stay up to date on all the latest videos you can follow me on instagram the guitar manifesto also check in the description below for other links to guitar manifesto merch and things like that so that will do for today thanks for watching hope you enjoyed it see you all soon peace guitar manifesto.